Naruto Gaming, the wait is over, buddy, because we're finally going to take a look at all Series 3 of the Moose Toys figures. What's up, Fortnite fans, and welcome back to Toys and James. As always, I'm James. These are the toys. All right. Today, we're going to check out all the Battle Royale Collection Series 3 Moose Toys figures. I'm going to try to keep it short, so it might be a two-part video, but we'll see how we're doing time-wise later, and let's dive right into it. We're going to check out the squad pack first with Dark Bomber, Deadfire, Sanctum, and Spider Knight. Very nice. This is all of them on the front. On the side, Dark Bomber, number 66, Deadfire, 63, Sanctum, 64, Spider Knight, 65. On the back is everybody else in the wave. These are other duo packs. We're going to open these after this one, and then we'll do the solo packs. Nothing over here, and let's open it up. First up, ladies first, we'll take a look at the Dark Bomber. Yes, yes, looking very nice in her purple outfit here. Nice purple tears coming down the face. You could get her at the shop for 1,200 V-Bucks. A rare skin from Season 6, The Future Looks Dark. Part of the Lightning and Thunderstorm set, and she looks really cool. And everybody comes with the stand like always, so we'll put her on that like this. Very nice. And like always, she comes with the rare Dark Bag. Very nice. Don't forget to pack an umbrella. You got this from buying her. I'll put this on her just like that. Yes, yes, there it is. Dark Bomber coming together. The pickaxe she comes with is the epic Thunder Crash. Wield the Thunder. Also part of the Lightning and Thunderstorm set. It's a really cool pickaxe right here. And we'll put this in her hand right here. Just like that. Oh yeah, she looks great. And that is the Dark Bomber. Very nice. Next up, we'll take a look at this cool cowboy. Deadfire. A legendary skin from Season 6. This town ain't big enough. Part of the Western Wild set. You got this guy at the shop for 2,000 V-Bucks. This guy came out part of the uh, Fort Nightmares Halloween 2018 uh, event. And this is a reactive skin. Normally he would just look like with a cowboy outfit on, almost like Calamity. But once you start out living people and dealing damage, you get all purple and glowing, coming out looking like this. This guy just looks really cool. Got his cowboy hat on here, all his little... Got his ammo and stuff, his nice jacket on, the spurs on the boots, just looking like a real cowboy. And we'll put him on his little stand here, like that. The back bling he gets is the legendary Shackled Stone. Keep it contained! Also part of the Western Wild set. This is a reactive uh, back bling as well. This would start to glow as you got more kills, and it just looks really cool. It's just like a purple rock with some chains around it. And we'll put this on his back, like that. Oh yeah. He's doing some killing. He's outlasting some people. This outfit's coming together here. The pickaxe he comes with is the epic Dark Shard. Splintered from Geometric Perfection. Also from Season 6, and this was a reactive pickaxe as well. This top piece would start glowing this color. It'd normally just be like a black or like a dark. Once it gets going, you can see some colors and some green flames. And we'll put this in his hand like that. Oh yeah, look at this guy. All the colors, the purples, the greens. He's just looking nice. Matching and everything. And you don't want to run into this guy in Tilted. And that's Deadfire. Next up, we'll take a look at this vampire-looking dude, Sanctum. An epic skin from Season 6. Be still your beating heart. Got this at the shop for 1,500 V-Bucks. Part of the Night Coven set. And this guy looks like the male version of Dusk. So this guy's really cool with his, like, little mask on here, looking like Bane mask. His red eyes and his, like, reddish hair, pinkish hair. He's got his fingernails painted, his little claws painted. And this guy will suck the blood out of you, alright? Already attached is the epic Coven Cape. Certified Coven Culture. You got this when you bought this skin, Sanctum. And this just looks really nice. Nice purple on this side. And then a nice, like, wrinkled fabric look on this side. And we'll put him on his stand here. Like that. Post it up. Very nice. He also comes with the epic Moonrise. Strike at Midnight. Watch. This was at the shop for 1200 V-Bucks. Got some nice like bat wing look up here, metal. A nice purple jewel that will glow. Very nice. I'm gonna put that in his hand. Like that. There he is looking awesome. And there was one gun out of the whole squad pack, the scoped AR. And it was closest to Sanctum, so we'll put that in his hands. He gets to have the weapon like that. And there's Sanctum looking awesome. And last, we'll take a look at this spider-looking dude. Ugh, I hate spiders. This guy looks really cool. A legendary skin from Season 6. They'll fall into your web. Got this at the shop for 2,000 V-Bucks. Part of the Arachnid set. This guy looks really cool with his helmet on. He's got his little dagger right here. Little spider chest piece. Armored up. 
the skirt hanging, got the spikes coming on the back of the helmet. This guy just looks really cool. And we'll put him on his stand here, like this. The back bling he gets is the legendary spider shield, spun from endless strands. This looks really cool, it's also like his face. Got the spider eyes all over the place, the horns looking really cool, and we'll put this on his back like that. Oh yeah, the spider knight's coming together now, looking really complete. The pickaxe he gets is the rare web breaker. Clear out the cobwebs. Also part of the arachnid set, you got this at the shop for 800 V-Bucks. Got some more spider eyes in here in the top here, looking scary and menacing. And we'll put that in his hand like that. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. This guy looks great. All his matching accessories and everything. Awesome. The Spider Knight. Next up, we'll take a look at our first duo pack, the Beef Boss and the Grill Sergeant. Nice look at them on the front. We'll flip it to the side. Beef Boss, number 52, Grill Sergeant, 53. Flip to the back, all the other duo packs, everybody else in the wave. Nothing over here, and let's open it up. All right, finally some service, please. Let's take a look at the Uncommon Grill Sergeant. Make it sizzle. From season five, got this at the shop for 800 V-Bucks, part of the Durberger set. And it looks like Jonesy got a summer job. And this guy looks really cool, just like a fry cook for the Durberger. Got his little headphones on so he can take your order. We'll put him on his little V-Buck here, like this. And the only thing he comes with is this little rare tomato toy. Splat. From Season 6, part of the Battle Pass, got this from Tier 28. And you can throw these around and hit people in the face. So we'll put this in his hand like this, just like that, looking really cool. Ready to throw a tomato at somebody, and it'll make that splat sound. Splat. And there's one gun between the two of them, the Burst Assault Rifle. So we'll put this in his hand. Since he's the employee, he'll probably be doing most of the work, so he's going to need this. Just like that. Oh yeah. Grill Sergeant's ready. Ready to slay out on kills and those fries. Alright. That is the Grill Sergeant. Matter of fact, you shouldn't even be holding a tomato because that's more of a pizza pit item. So I'm gonna need to speak to your manager, sir. Alright, we finally got a manager down here. This is the guy behind it all. The Beef Boss himself. Victory well done. I'm more of a medium rare guy myself. This is an epic skin from Season 5. Part of the Durberger set. Got this at the shop for 1,500 V-Bucks. This guy just looks awesome with this big old burger on his head. Got this tongue hanging out. Very nice. Rocking like the lavender and orange Durberger colors. Got the little uh, mustard and ketchup on the side here, just in case your condiments weren't the best. This guy's giving you the thumbs up, saying the food is good. And we'll put him on his stand like this. Very nice. The back bling he gets is the epic deep fried, perfectly greasy. This is just like got the Durberger right there representing my nice side of fries. Very nice, making me hungry. And we'll put this on his back. Oh yeah, very professional, looking awesome. This, this guy with his Durberger face. He also comes with the uncommon patty whacker. If you can't stand the heat, also part of the Durberger set. You got this at the shop for 500 V-Bucks. And it's just an awesome spatula. So we'll put this in his hand. Like that. Oh yeah. There he is. Beef Boss on the job. Ready to fire up some patties like Spongebob. This guy's just looking awesome. And that is the Beef Boss. Let me know in the comments. You guys team Durberger or team Pizza Pit? Me, myself, I'm undecided. All right, next up, we'll take a look at another scary looking duo pack. Hey Man and Hollowhead. On this side, Hey Man 54, Hollowhead 55. On the back, everybody else we already know about. Nothing over here, and let's open them up. All right, first up, we'll take a look at the epic Hey Man. Hey Man. Hey Man. Hey. Hey Man. Hey Man. Hey Man. Scare those crows. This guy looks really cool. He's like a scarecrow. Got a nice evil looking scarecrow face. Got the orange eyes. Got a nice little bird skull hanging out. Got the purples, the oranges, just looking really cool. Part of the stuffed straw set. This guy's also part of the Halloween Fort Nightmares uh, event. And we'll put him on his little stand here. Like that. Very nice. He almost looks like the scarecrow from Batman, but with much brighter colors. You got this guy at the shop for 1500 V-Bucks. And the back bling he gets is the epic Hey Nest. Hey, hey Nest, hatch a plan. This thing's really cool. It's like a little scarecrow sunflower. And we'll put this on his back like that. Oh yeah, there he goes. Gonna scare some crows. Looking cool. He also comes with the rare harvester pickaxe. Reap what you sow. Got this at the shop for 800 V-Bucks. It's like a nice little sickle on a stick. And we'll put this in his hand like that. Oh yeah. And those crows don't stand a chance when they see this guy. And there's one gun between them, the double barrel shotgun, the sawed off shotgun. And we'll put this in his hand like this. All right. Is he going to scare those crows or kill them? Jeez. He's going to shoot them in the face. 
And that is the awesome Hey Man. Hey Man. Next up, we'll take a look at the awesome looking Hollow Head. Very nice. All tricks, no treats. Sounds like my ex-girlfriend. The epic skin from season six. Got this at the shop for 1,500 V-Bucks. Part of the pumpkin patch set. This guy looks awesome with his nice claws. It's like metal claws. Got this big old jack-o'-lantern pumpkin head. The green and the dark throughout. Got this nice orange and uh, black cape. Just looking really cool. And this guy looks like Ghost Rider or like the Headless Horseman from Sleepy Hollow or something like that. And just like Sanctum, he has this cape here. This is already attached. This is the epic moldering cloak. Ragged and worn from days long gone. This is the back bling that came when you bought him. Also part of the pumpkin patch set. And we'll put him on his big V-Buck here. Very nice, looking cool. And he comes with the rare carver. Honed for the harvest. Another sickle looking pickaxe. Nice big old blade up top on this like metal staff here. You get this at the shop for 800 V-Bucks. Also part of the pumpkin patch set. And we'll put this in his hand like that. Oh yeah, there it is. This guy's looking scary and awesome. And that is hollow head. Very nice. All right, next up we'll take a look at these white suits. Wild card diamond and wild card clubs. Very nice. On this side, wild card diamond 50D and wild card clubs 51C. On the back, everybody else, and let's open it up. All right, first up, we'll take a look at wild card clubs. Pick a card, any card. You can tell it's clubs because he has the big old clubs on his face. And that's a funny word I just realized, clubs. Big old pile of clubs. All right. This guy looks really cool. He's like a little henchman. Got his all white suit on. Got the mask on, protecting his identity. We just know him as clubs. A legendary skin from season six. Got this at the shop for 2,000 V-Bucks. Part of the getaway gang set. And we'll put him on his little stand here. Pose him up. There it is, like that. And the back bling he gets is the cuff case. Always by your side. The legendary back bling you got when you bought the wild card skin. I'll put that on his back just like that. There he goes. Looking like he's about to plan a heist. Very nice. He also comes with the silent pistol that we'll put in his hand. Like that. All right. And there he is. Looking nice. Ready to plan the getaway. And that's wild card clubs. The next wild card we'll look at is wild card diamonds. And you know it's diamonds because look at the diamond in the eye. <laughs> This guy's really cool. He already came with uh, one part of his dual pistols already in his hand. And this guy looks just like the other guy, except he has the diamond in his eye, but the same white mask, same white suit here. And we'll put him on his stand like that. All right, this guy's looking cool. And the back bling he gets is the Crystal Llama. Shiny, the rare back bling from season six. It's also in the Getaway Gang set. You got this back bling when you won some of the, uh, like the high stakes, the Getaway matches. All these guys are part of the Getaway, like that event, the, the high stakes event. But I think this is uh, the diamond one. It comes with a couple different colors. And we'll put this on his back like, that oh yeah that looks great against the white suit this guy's just looking really cool and then here is the other dual pistol that we'll put in this hand like that all right yeah now this guy's looking cool posted up with his dual pistols just like that and here we have the wild card diamond very nice and we'll keep it moving right along with the wild cards. This time we got hearts and spades, all right? And then on this side, wild card hearts, 50H, wild card spades, 51S. On the back, everybody else, and let's open it up. All right, first up, we'll take a look at wild card hearts. You know it's the hearts because of the big old heart in his eye. This guy looks just like the others, except he's got a heart on his mask. And we'll put him on his V-Buck stand here, just like that. Posed up nice, looking good. And with him, we'll give him the rare crowbar. Pry away. Also from season six. And we'll put this in his hand like that. Oh yeah, he's ready to break into some stuff right now. Ready to crack some safes open and such. And we'll also give to him, this is the first time we've seen this, the P90 or the Peen, I like to say. This gun's really cool. It's got the nice green uh, end here. And we'll put this in his hand like this. Here we go. All right, this guy's looking cool. He's got his crowbar pickaxe. He's a nice Peen, ready to go. <laughs> Shoot really fast. This guy looks great, just like the rest. That is Wild Card Hearts. Next up, we'll take a look at the last wild card, wild card spades. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You know it's a spade because he has the big old spade in his eye, and that's what separates him from the rest. 
So we'll put him on his V-Buck here, just like that, posed up nice, looking good. He comes with a couple cool things we haven't seen before, like this, the guided missile. Yes, yes, this thing's really cool. I used to hate this uh, when this was around. This has since been vaulted because it was too powerful, or OP as they say. This gun first came out in like season three, and we haven't seen it since. But we'll put this in his hand, just like that. Oh yeah, this gun looks great, him holding it like that. Ready to shoot this missile. <laughs> And guide it right to your one by one. Another cool gadget he comes with is the Epic Grappler. Very nice. Or the Plunger Gun. This came out in Season 6. This has also been vaulted. And this thing shoots this plunger and you're able to like stick to things. And this gun's really cool so we'll put this in his hand. Like that. Alright. Yeah. There he goes. Yeah. And this guy's a threat. Ready to plunger up to your box and then guide that missile right in there. And that is Wild Card Spades. All right, and there's the whole wild card gang all posted up, looking awesome. All the different ones, the spades, the diamonds, the hearts, the clubs. That's the whole deck right there, looking like some true gangsters. All right, next up, we'll take a look at our last duo pack, the Star Spangled Trooper and the Fireworks Team Leader. And I saved the best for last, because according to the list that everything comes with, these are rare. This is a rare pack, so let's check it out. All right, on the side, we have Star Spangled Trooper, number 56, Fireworks team leader number 57 on the back everybody else and let's open it up All right, we'll take a look at the fireworks team leader first This is just a, a repaint of the cuddle team leader because she's still doing the uh, true love emote here But she's still really cool an epic skin from season four life liberty and the bear suit of happiness Bear suit instead of pursuit bear suit funny stuff This was at the shop for 1500 v-bucks part of the stars and stripes set and this is obviously like a fourth of july celebration outfit here but she looks really good because you get the blue fur on her nice blue bear and you get the nice uh american flag style pants here the red the white and the blue very patriotic looking really nice and we'll put her on her stand here like that all right she comes with the epic blasting cap back bling it's a blast this is like uncle sam's hat with like some fireworks in it very fourth of july and we'll put this on her back here Ah, it's a tight fit with this big head, but it works. Oh, looking good, looking good. And with her, we also get a med kit, which is very nice to see. Only the second time we've seen one of these. And we'll put this on her thing so she can heal up. Just like that. There we go. She might have got hurt lighting some fireworks, because now she needs to heal up. And there we have the fireworks team leader. Very nice. And here comes another guy ready to celebrate the 4th, really getting into the spirit. The Uncommon Star Spangled Trooper. Salute your stripes. From Season 4, it's at the shop for 800 V-Bucks. Also part of the Stars and Stripes set. And this is just a repaint of the classic old Jonesy. This guy looks great with his blue pants, nice blue scarf right here with the stars got the red and the white shirt on here oh look at those muscles this guy's ripped oh man this guy just looks ready to go so we'll put him on his stand here all right there it is and just like a default jonesy would have he comes with the default standard pickaxe the common pickaxe that everybody comes with and we'll put this in his back just like that there we go he's posed up nice looking good and just like jonesy would have he comes with the tack shoddy the classic tack shoddy that jonesy would have and we'll put that in his hands that are made to hold this gun just like that and then you close it down yeah and that hand grabs that and there we have just an awesome looking jonesy pose but with this guy looking awesome and that is the star spangled trooper all right, you guys, that's going to do it for this video. That's everybody we got today so far. I don't want to make this video that long, so we're going to stop it right here. That's the squad pack and all the duo packs so far. We'll open up the rest of the solo packs in part two, so stay tuned for part two. As always, I appreciate you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one.